German Bionic, a leading global robotics company, announced its new partnership with Servco Pacific to introduce exoskeletons to Hawaii. Chris Latronic joins us now live from Mapunapuna with more. Good morning, Chris. <laughs> Good morning to you, Sarah. Sam, can you hear my bionicness? It's pretty cool. It's a brand new German bionic exoskeletons, the Apogee and Apogee Plus. Uh, that one's medical grade. That one can take some uh, harsher chemicals for being in the lab, but it's been pretty cool uh, playing with this new toy that's going to help revolutionize, revolutionize the industry here in Hawaii. And here to tell us more is our friend Carson Chun, who's been helping us out. Uh, so tell me again, kind of the features of these brand new exoskeletons. So these guys help you lift up to 80 pounds off your back. So if you're lifting 90 pounds, 80 pounds of that would be through the exoskeleton and 10 pounds on your back. It also helps with walking assist. So if you're pulling a heavy, some heavy loads, it'll help you uh, save some energy as you're pulling that and, uh, you know, picking things off crate. A lot of bending and lifting, that's what this one is for. Yes. And uh, th th it's kind of this application trying to help uh, keep workers from getting injured, right? Keep workers from work to, to keep working, right? Um, you want to keep working, not, not have to sit on the couch, miss time with your loved ones, or even away from work if you enjoy work. But, um, you know, the productivity increases, the, the, the morale increases, and then, you know, this is such a great tool to have. Yes, and that was a great point with just, uh, I feel, I, mean, I don't know how many stories I've heard where people working all week and then too tired to do anything uh, over the weekend, just sleep and be lazy, uh, just recovering for the next week, but instead, you'll have less weight on your back and more energy when you get to the weekend. So, okay, I'm gonna uh, do the walking assist, kind of walk me through what I'm doing. All right, so you're just gonna pull this tire over to the crate. As you can see, the, the tire is a little weighted. Um, that help you push your legs through as you're walking. And uh, once he stops, he's gonna lift that tire in. So once he bends over, as he's standing up, you can hear. Ooh, oh my, that was, like, that was like a feather. There you go. And, then... and as you're putting it down, there's a resistance to help you ease down so you don't get jolted down by the weight. No, no weight on my back. That was amazing. And the walking assist, I could feel it kind of give me a little push on each of my legs and wow. My back not, not feeling any kind. And also tomorrow, there's a big way you could see this up close and personal. Yeah, if you're going to be at the PVX24 convention at the convention center, uh, swing on by. We have an exoskeleton booth along with other forklift booth that we have. So I'd love to see you there. Yeah, it should be pretty cool. How long do the batteries actually last? So to how long can a worker actually work with these on? So these batteries last four to six hours, depending on the use. Uh, they're easily obtainable online. Uh, they're your basic you know, power tool Makita battery. Uh, you, they're hot swappable, so if you take it out, the exoskeleton will run for five additional minutes without the battery, so you could easily swap it, keep your profile, keep the statistics going, and yeah, keep going. That's amazing. We'll also have more information on our website at k2and2.com. So time for Bionic Latron to get to work. Working for Hawaii, back to you. That is so cool. Look at this guy. Wow! <laughs> Okay, Chris, be careful, though, because the thing's not helping your shoulder. Right? It's helping your back, so it's still it's strong, though. I know, but so, he can carry it, like, you saw how he picked it up? Yeah. It looks so light It's amazing. Him. Yeah, he said it's like a feather. Yeah. It just is, like, welcome to the future moment right there. Uh, also, we workshopped some nicknames. Uh, we landed on Bionic Latronic. Yeah, yeah He looks like favorite. Iron Man with that thing, you know, Tony Stark, <laughs> like Tony Shaka that didn't really work, but, yeah, I'm glad we found the right one right there.